It is complete to step on Diggs. Diggs at the 45 and at the 40 and at the 35 and the 30. 25, 20, 15, running for the left angle of the end zone. Five, touchdown, step on Diggs. Training camp is about making us better as a team, coming together. It's just about the everyday grind. KD. Wake up early, go to bed late. No, you just have to find the spot. Be in mind to keep pushing you through and working hard every day. Just happy that CJ's back. Just thankful I had the opportunity to be out here with these guys. CJ Brown's back, that's my guy. We got some weapons here. You know, then you got Stephon. Then with wide receiver Stephon Diggs, you guys look like you push one another in practice. It's all about competing because you want the bragging rights when you walk in the locker room. Bang, bang, bang. We have a chip on our shoulder as a defense. Defense to me is basically about attitude, You're playing with aggression. When we get on the field, it's just compete, make each other better. So that's what it is. It's great white and big red. Great white and big red. I'm ready to get to the season, man. Thank you. Appreciate you coming out. Much love from the fans. We go out here and practice every day and get better. We do it for them. You think this team is good enough right now to shock you? You know, don't let your teammate down. As well as our slogan, hold the rope. Hold the rope. Happy to have you with us on an absolutely gorgeous day for a college game in College Park. The Maryland Terrapins, they kick off the 121st season of Maryland football here in College Park. Brown looking to throw for the first time, and that is caught. Down the near sideline, Laverne Jacobs. Going through fall camp, I felt very confident, you know, with the offense and, you know, with myself and uh, my ability to run and throw and things of that nature. And um, I've had a lot of doubters, you know, about, you know, the accuracy and that you can only you know, run and you can throw. And uh, to come out that first game and have the success that we did, mute the critics, per se, with the time that I put in the offseason, having a second year underneath the offense, it, it really paid dividends. And this is Brown carrying the ball. 15, 10. Touchdown, Maryland. Looks to throw this Brown. Open, goings. Touchdown, Maryland. Maryland wins it this afternoon, 43 to 10. They open up the season at a very dominating note. Game number two this week against Old Dominion Mono. Makes the tackle to the 40, gets to the 35 yard line, down the sideline. 20, 15, 10, 5, dives, and somersaults in the end zone. And they get to him and wrestle him down. He is hit and sacked by Marcus Whitfield. Pick block, intercepted on the play. Sean Davis has got it. He's on the other side of the 40 and the 30. Hit for the end zone. He's got a score. 52 yards return. What a tremendous losing grab. Wins it 47 to 10. Perfect night, cool, chilly night here in East Hartford, Connecticut, as Randy Ansel returns to the school he coached for 12 years. Whitmer intercepted on the sidelines by McDougal across the 35 or the 30. I just got this smile on my face, so I take off running. I turn around to block somebody. Dex is already happy with the end zone. Off for the touchdown. Uh, e Lyman, he crashed. And I you know, hit the crease and just took it to the house. Now Brown keeps it up the middle. Brown to the 20, to the 15, to the 10, the 5. The touchdown for C.J. Brown. 40-yard run right up the gut of the Husky. You know, baby, it's a great feeling. Great feeling. Come on. Go, go. Maryland has won it 32 to 21. You've never seen anything like this before. No one has. And no one will again until the Terps take the field on Saturday against the Mountaineers. Introducing the 2013 University of Maryland Pride 2.0 uniform. This is Maryland Pride. And off again, left side of the line, nothing doing. And he's hit and dropped to the play. Darius Kilgold. Brown sets up. Ball is tipped and then caught for the touchdown. Dave Steinbaum. Childress pops 
to the right side. Intercepted by Hendy. Hendy down the sidelines. Touchdown, Maryland! 2001, the last time the Terrapins started a season 4-0. On the way to winning the ACC championship that year. And for the 78th time, Virginia and Maryland meet in football. The final time as members of the Atlantic Coast Conference. Caleb Brown throws the screen. It's complete. Ross across the 25 of the 30. Up to the 35 of the 40. Dodges him at it midfield. A race down the sideline. 30, 25 of the 20. Looking for the block at the 15, at the 10, at the 5. And he's down to the two-yard line. Here's Ross again. Over the top he goes. He's in the end zone for the touchdown. I was walking on the field, I seen my parents, and I pointed to them just to let them know that I see them, and I, I respect the support that they show me, and I love them with all my heart. And the Terrapins for the 27-26 win today over Virginia. One of the things I've always enjoyed about homecoming is you see so many people coming back and reliving their days either as a student or student athlete here at the University of Maryland. Especially for guys that played football with their teammates to relive the great days that they had uh, playing here at Bird Stadium. Randy White's recognized probably as the most dominant defensive guy they ever had played at the University of Maryland. Came out in 1974, and of course, so many people remember him from his great days with the Dallas Cowboys. It's special for me just to have an opportunity to come back here to the to the stadium and be, and be a part of the game. A lot of my teammates are around for this game, so it brings back a lot of good memories. Uh, my time here at the University of Maryland and actually being able to participate a little bit in the new era here. For us to go out there in a hostile environment, you know, the last time we're going to play Virginia Tech. by Hughes, likely no fair catch at the 40, up to the 45, up the midfield, jukes a man at the 40, one man to beat, he's going to go all the way, down to the 15, to the 10, and the 5, and a touchdown from Maryland. Terrapins are three yards away from the goal line and three yards away from a touchdown, which would win it. Well, you know, it was a play action pop pass to the tight end. You know, he got washed down, he kind of got tackled. And I was like, uh-oh. So I kind of just scrambled to the left. Brown running to the left, trying to turn the corner, dives for the pylon. He got in! Touchdown! Maryland wins! Wow. It is really time to celebrate. 27 to 24, Maryland in overtime. We welcome you to the 70th meeting of the Terrapins and Wolfpack in football. Today, the curtain comes down on Maryland's years in the Atlantic Coast Conference. I just gave him, a, gave him a chance to go make a play, and uh, he's been doing it all year. And you know, I have you know, trust and faith in him, and uh, he came down with it. Caught at the 10 in the end zone for the touchdown. Got him again and dropping back at the 10-yard line. The 39 yard mark. There's a fake. Rattle deep it up the middle. He's going to outrun the secondary at the 20, the 15, the 10, the 5, and a touchdown for CJ Brown. And the Terrapins can start to celebrate. Merrill winds up with a 41 to 21 win today over North Carolina State. In the big boy, so glorious. And to see our team victorious, we got the team boys, we got the team boys, keep fighting, don't give in. Let's just keep doing this, and knowing what we're all about, and knowing how special this feels, so we can continue this for a long, long time. Yeah.